Have you ever wondered how the Fidelity Blue Chip Growth Fund stacks up against the competition? In the world of investment, where every second counts and every decision matters, it's important to understand your options. One such option is the Fidelity Blue Chip Growth Fund, a fund that's carved a niche for itself by focusing on large cap stocks with above average earnings growth and sustainable business models. It's a fund that doesn't just look at the present but plans for the future, seeking out businesses that are poised to stand the test of time. And it does this through a meticulous bottom-up fundamental analysis, seeking to exploit mispriced growth rates while emphasizing a company's competitive advantage, pricing power, and management team. So, are you ready to dive deep into the world of large-cap stocks and the Fidelity Blue Chip Growth Fund? Join us as we dissect the fund's performance against industry benchmarks. Diving into the numbers, the Fidelity Blue Chip Growth Fund has been a high performer. Over the past decade, the fund has delivered an impressive 15.51% return. Now, let's add some perspective to this figure by comparing it with industry benchmarks. Turning our gaze to the S&P 500, we see that the Fidelity Blue Chip Growth Fund has outperformed this benchmark. This is no small feat as the S&P 500 is widely regarded as a reliable indicator of the overall performance of the U.S. stock market. Next, let's consider Vanguard's Mega Cap Growth ETF, also known as MGK. Here again, the Fidelity Blue Chip Growth Fund has managed to outpace its competitor, demonstrating a strong ability to deliver consistent returns over a long period. Now let's shift our focus to the tech-centric Invesco QQQ. This fund, which focuses on the technology sector, is one of the top performing ETFs in the market. While the Fidelity Blue Chip Growth Fund falls slightly behind the QQQ, its 10-year annualized return remains a robust testament to its performance. So what does all this mean? It means that the Fidelity Blue Chip Growth Fund has consistently provided strong returns over the past decade, outperforming key benchmarks in the process. It's a fund that has demonstrated its ability to thrive in a variety of market conditions, making it a compelling choice for those seeking above average growth. But numbers, while important, are just one part of the story. They can indicate past performance, but they can't predict the future. That's why it's crucial to dig deeper, to understand the strategies and philosophies that drive a fund's performance, and to consider the potential risks as well as the rewards. Impressive, right? But let's dig deeper. It's not all about returns. Costs matter too. When we peek into the financials of the Fidelity Blue Chip Growth Fund, we find an expense ratio of 0.69%. Now you might be asking, how does that stack up against its competitors? Well, let's take a look. The Vanguard Mega Cap ETF, or MGK, boasts a significantly lower expense ratio of 0.05%. The Invesco QQQ isn't far behind with an expense ratio of 0.2%. Even the Vanguard S&P 500 fund manages to keep expenses down with a ratio of 0.04%. So yes, the Fidelity Blue Chip Growth Fund does come with a heftier price tag. But before you make a judgment call, remember this. It's not all about costs. Higher costs, yes. But let's consider the fund's overall performance. It's about the balance between costs and returns, and the Fidelity Blue Chip Growth Fund has demonstrated that balance admirably. Investing is not without risks, and the Fidelity Blue Chip Growth Fund is no exception. Like any investment opportunity, it carries its own set of challenges, which are crucial to understand before diving in. One of these is the fund's concentration into fewer stocks, which can lead to volatile swings influenced by market forces. This calls for a careful balancing act, where the potential rewards are weighed against the risks involved, highlighting the importance of a well-rounded risk-reward profile. Let's delve into some critical metrics that help assess the fund's risk and volatility. First up is the beta. As of the end of December 2023, the beta stands at 1.12. This suggests that the fund tends to be slightly more volatile than the overall market. In essence, when the market moves, the Fidelity Blue Chip Growth Fund tends to move a bit more. Next up is the R2 value. As of the same date, it stands at 0.94.
This signifies a strong correlation with the market. Essentially, it indicates that most of the fund's movements can be explained by overall market trends. Then we have the Sharp Ratio, at 0.14. As of December 2023, it provides insight into the fund's risk-adjusted returns. This metric gauges the fund's performance in relation to the risk it takes on, with a higher Sharp Ratio indicating better risk-adjusted performance. Lastly, let's look at the Standard Deviation a measure of how much the fund's returns deviate from its average return. As of the end of December 2023, it's registered at 24.03, pointing to moderate volatility. Essentially, it gives us an idea of the extent of variation from the fund's average return. These numbers reflect the fund's resilience in the face of market volatility. They serve as a testament to its ability to navigate the unpredictable ups and downs of the market, underlining its robustness as an investment option. So, what's the final verdict on the Fidelity Blue Chip Growth Fund? After our meticulous exploration, the fund clearly sets itself apart with its above-average returns and impressive resilience in the face of market volatility. It's a testament to the strength of its strategic focus on large-cap stocks with sustainable business models and above-average earnings growth. Yes, the expense ratio is higher than some competitors, but let's not lose sight of the bigger picture. The fund's superior performance and robust management justify this cost, especially for those investors seeking a balanced risk-reward profile. Remember, the world of investment is never static. It's a constantly shifting landscape that demands careful research, a clear understanding of your financial goals, and a thorough assessment of your risk tolerance. With these ingredients, you're well equipped to make informed decisions. So in the ever-evolving investment landscape, it is wise to seek the counsel of a certified financial advisor when considering such funds. This video is an interesting and entertaining deep dive into the world finance and investing. So thank you for watching. Click the link in the description to see the full detailed PDF on the Fidelity Blue Chip Growth Fund as it emerges as a compelling option for the discerning investor and a powerhouse for Main Street.